Hey loves, welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Z to the U R E A Zora. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how you can trim your brows at home. Okay, so if that sounds like something you are interested in, you want to keep on watching. So guys, you're going to be needing a spoolie, which we'll use to brush through our brows to the direction that we want. So this is very very helpful and we're also going to be needing a hair gel or a petroleum jelly so if you don't have a hair gel you can as well use petroleum jelly that is vaseline this is going to help to make the trimming process very very easy and we'll also be needing a razor blade so i have this twinkle razor blade right here which comes with a handle or you can use the regular razor blade so when it comes to razor blade you want to make sure that you are using a brand new razor blade and do not share your razor blade with anyone okay and we'll also need baby wipes to clean and also a mirror so we can see what we are doing so guys to get started i'm just gonna go into my gel and take a little bit of that and i'm just gonna use that to brush through my brows so this helps the razor blade to glide through very easily and also helps to keep my brows in place so i can see what i am trimming or what i am working with okay so for the razor blade i'm gonna show you guys how i use it so i don't get to fully open it so what i do is i'm just going to split this part up into two while opening it instead of opening the whole thing so this way i don't get to scrape my eyelashes when trimming my brows so it just helps me to focus more on the small section that is open so this is what i am talking about like you can see the razor actually touching my eyelashes so you don't want to have this so that's why i split it open halfway so when trimming you want to start with cleaning the bottom part of the brows first so that we have like a straight line and you want to do this while stretching your skin so you can either stretch your skin in two ways you either stretch your skin with the other hand but currently i am carrying a mirror so i can't do that or you can as well raise your brows which is what i'm gonna be doing like if you look closely you will notice that i am raising my brows up so this way it enables the razor blade to glide smoothly okay so when trimming another important thing that you have to have in mind is that you have to follow the natural pattern of your brows so you need to know your brow type also when cleaning don't overdo it you need to take it bit by bit until you're satisfied with what you are doing so you need to do it line by line until you get there So I have a wipe right here so you can always clean your razor blade so it doesn't get too messy and if you have like an acne prone skin please be extra extra careful so you don't pop your pimples. Next I'm going to take more of the hair gel and just brush through upwards. So for the top part this is how you want to hold your razor blade when trimming okay. So you want to trim very very slightly. So basically you want to trim the hairs that is overgrown. Take your time when trimming guys. I cannot overemphasize this enough. Please take your time when trimming. Do not be in a rush. Don't be in a hurry. Just take your time. Trim it line by line. Trim it step by step. So whatever you do, okay, do not try to cut too much. Just go in gently and with nice gentle strokes because it's a razor blade guys. I mean, you do not want to hurt yourself. Thank you. 
so right now the next thing that i'm going to do is i'm going to brush this downwards and you can see from brushing my hair downwards that some hair strands are overgrown like they are over the line the straight line that we had earlier so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to trim this part okay i'm going to trim this part following the already straight line that we already have I'm just going to clean this up so we can look at what we have or what we are working with so guys this is one of the reasons why I said you should use a brand new razor blade and that you shouldn't share your razor blade with anybody you can see that I have some cuts on my skin already please you have to be very 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 careful okay guys so next I'm just going to also brush up or clean up the upper parts of my skin okay because i'm very hairy guys so i need this to be as neat as possible so that's what i'm doing right now so brushing this upward this is what we have and this is pretty decent to work with i can as well brush it downwards and we can see that no strand is coming out of place this is pretty decent so this is what the other brow is looking like and we can definitely see the difference between both brows guys so this is pretty decent and we can go ahead to outline our brows or draw our brows so i'm gonna allow you guys to keep watching this video and i believe that when you watch this video over and over again you're going to learn and understand how to groom and grow your brows by yourself so for my left side brow i'm going to be using this twinkle razor blade here yeah so that's what i'm going to be using i'm going to show you guys how to use this so this is very very easy to use i prefer using this than using a razor blade because this just helps you you know to um control the direction that it moves and all of that so guys yeah that's it about this video do not forget to like comment if this video was helpful to you and also subscribe to my youtube channel if you're yet to subscribe to my youtube channel keep watching the video i love you so i'm also going to clean up the middle section of my brows because i have like a v-shaped brows and i always take that out so that's what i am doing and after that we're done guys and i'll just clean that up and the yeah, this is what we are working with guys i can brush that upwards brush it downwards and no hair is going out of place everything is pretty decent it is pretty nice i can as well outline my brows and draw my brows or even go about my day like this this is very very okay and very nice to work with and yeah this is what our brows is looking like after trimming and grooming our brows this is very easy to do guys yeah this is it. it's very nice don't forget to subscribe to my channel guys and like this video and leave a comment down in the comment section i love you guys thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video bye